Angelique and I and Ricky are at the laundromat waiting for Angela's clothes to be washed and dried. And, and blankets. Uh, we've been doing our celery juice cleanse. And so I have the next, I think I have days three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine coming up. And we'll be, we've been doing our celery juice vlogging. So that I'm, that's what's gonna come up after this. 20th day of celery juice tomorrow. Yeah, Angelique hasn't missed a day. I missed two days, Christmas day and the day after. But she's such a good girl. Okay, so today is December 30th. I'm on day four of my celery juice challenge. Um, um, day 13. Day 13. We drink celery juice once or sometimes twice a day. We do eat our meals, but um, we do make sure that we have our celery juice on an empty stomach. <clears throat> Everybody should do this on an empty stomach every morning. Yeah. It's very good for you. But I also, I am going to treat myself and I put a carrot and an apple in my second glass of juice because I treat myself after I get down the not so good tasting juice. It's, I, it's not that bad. <laughs> it tastes like water with a little hint of celery. It's just kind of bland. But th this one tastes a lot better with the carrot and, a, and a apple in it. Hey, if you got the juicer out, you might as well put some other things to get down. Yeah, so. that's what I thought. So <laughs> give me a little more juice for the day. Later, or for lunch, I would like to make tacos. I don't know why I'm craving tacos. No, that's so all I've been thinking about for three days. Yeah, Probably because I watch way. Uncle John's channel and he's always making tacos. So I think it's stuck in mm. my head now from his channel. Look at this cool set of puffy pens that I have. This is um, for painting on cloth. And look at that. I want to do some, I think I'm going to go to Michael's and see, or the dollar store, see if I can find a white t-shirt and then paint a picture with this. I've been looking at these for over a year. I've had these. So I'm excited about trying them. Last night, because I the shoes on the back of this reminded me, and then I looked up some more YouTube videos about these shoes, and I have been wanting shoes like this for like a while now. So I know what I want. What kind of shoes? Doc Martens. <clears throat> I know which ones I want. How much are they? They're... Like over 200. Oh my goodness, Angelique. That's no, way too but much. But they're such good shoes. They last forever. A girl has been wearing hers for like over 10 years now. These are them. One. Six. Oh, oh, I see. Six. They, well, those look like army boots. No wonder they last for 10 years. <laughs> Aren't you funny? <laughs> no wonder. They well, look the, very durable. Look at the heel on them. They're like an inch and a half thick. So who's wearing these? Where have you seen these? I have never even seen them. Show them what they look like. Let me know if you like these kind of boots or not. They, they, like, they look like they're heavy. Are they heavy boots? Mom, you need to watch a review on them. Okay. You need to get used to them, people say, before wearing them. So they say try them out, wear them out a few times before you like actually go out in them. Mm -hmm. They're like, it's gonna feel a bit weird wearing them your first few times but it's a good way of getting extra exercise <laughs> oh are you funny <laughs> carrying all that weight around you don't need any ankle weights she thinks she's so funny right now <laughs> you might might be able to use those to go hiking be, mm. your, be your hiking boots the girl that did the review mm -hmm. she wore her boots she went hiking in iceland and she's like and look how good they still are oh they held up to hike yeah oh Wow. Hike in style. Yeah. I talked to Aunt Debbie today, and she said that today the Epilepsy Awareness Fingernail Nail Polish is launched today. Today they're launching the first Epilepsy Nails, and they're purple and have designs. Oh, so that's what she texted she, me about. Yeah, mine. so that's what she wanted you to know. I watched Uncle John's video last night. He was super happy that he found his wallet or his ID, and I talked to Aunt Carol She's coming back from Florida in a few days. And I talked to grandma and she's bored out of her skull. She, she, she just says she's doing nothing just like she does every day. Just trying to keep busy. She's putting together puzzles. All right, don't go away. We'll be right back.
Well, that was a picture of my tacos and they were so disappointing. I looked forward to them all day and they tasted nothing like I thought they were going to taste. I don't know what I did wrong, but. Here, Ricky wants to do something with you. Okay, repeat It wasn't after me. what I was okay. expecting. Repeat after me. Okay, what? Grass is green. Grass is green. What's the color of the, of the sky? Blue. Oh, you didn't repeat after me. You didn't repeat after me. Wait, did I say it wrong? Yeah, you did. You're supposed to repeat after me. <laughs> To me, and it on me too. Oh, because I'm trying to, I was gonna, I'm trying to outsmart him, and I'm, I'm sitting here thinking, okay, I've got to make sure I say the right answer. <laughs> okay, I was still outsmarted. Okay, Angelique and I are on day. I'm 15. I'm day five. I made her celery juice for her today. Yes, thank you, Ann. See, is that nice? We get each yeah. other whenever we need it. Yeah. We're there for each yeah. other. Okay, so today is January 3rd. It's my seventh day of the celery juice cleanse. And I actually did seven days. I skipped two days and now I'm on my seventh day again. Here it goes. Yeah, it still tastes the same. <laughs> like, cel like celery. Okay, it's January 5th and I'm on day nine of my celery juice cleanse. And Angelique is on day- 19. 19. And um, yeah, I'm feeling a lot more energetic with the juice, juicing. I did have a couple days of diarrhea after the juice, but I think I just was drinking too much that day. But a lady that I used to go to church with about 20 years ago, she always said that if you get sick with a cold or the flu or diarrhea, all of that, that's just your body cleansing itself. So. I look at it as a good thing because I've been feeling a lot better after that. So I just cut down on the celery juice a little bit for a couple of days and now I'm back to the normal amount and I'm and I'm still good. So how about you, Ange? How are you feeling? I I haven't taken Ativan for 18 days, but that I did last night. And I think it's just because of my sleep schedule, how I am. That's why I... You didn't take a whole one though, did you? I took half. It was maybe like a little over half. So you took a half? You have one milligrams, so you took a half of a milligram. But that's good for 18 days. That I'm getting my dogs tomorrow, so. Oh boy, the puppies are coming back tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. But lots of fun. <laughs> okay, we'll see you later. All right, bye. bye. Tomorrow, we're gonna be picking up Sadie Cola, my two dogs. She's getting her room all ready, all nice and clean. Yeah. Washing everything. It's, it's funny how how you're cleaning up your room for dogs. I'm excited. <laughs> My room hasn't been clean for the longest time. And then as, as soon as I It's clean. That, it's just... You it's just, just have... Uh, no, I have clothes all over the floor. No, you, that's it. You just have so much stuff. So many things. She's, she loves saying that. Well, anyway, my dogs are coming home tomorrow and... What time? I can't wait. What time? I have no idea. What time? I, whenever you want. Three o'clock. Whenever you feel like going for a ride. I have a few goals for 2021 and it's to get my house finished and especially my studio because I would really love to do some studio vlogs and some studio art lessons. So I would love to hear what your goals for 2021 are. I really hope 2021 is going to be happier and more comfortable than 2020. And I will see you all in the next video.